lot of families around, nice neighbors. Uh, community in San Carlos is fairly tight. Um, you start to get to know everybody and you know, you become like, you, you build friendships with people out here. I like the fact that it has this nice little downtown that I can walk to every day, pick up food for dinner. Basically, it's a mellow, mellow downtown area. Plenty of shopping. I mean, you can find just about anything you need out here. Anywhere from cigars to dry cleaning. I mean, great places to eat, nice restaurants. The thing about downtown is that it's not chains. I mean, there are a, a few of the usual suspects like Blockbuster and Starbucks, but beyond that, it's actually uh, businesses that are owned by individuals that you can go and uh, enjoy and the owners are on hand, so you feel community. This is a very family-friendly community. You, you feel a lot of support from the schools and from just the neighbors, the people that move here. Everybody has that same sense of uh, taking care of the kids and making this a great community to raise family. Even though I've not lived here more than five years, I seem to have uh, already know people and uh, people are all outgoing and friendly. You know, everybody knows everybody. You come to the coffee shop, you see the same people out here every day. It's really a nice place to live. The weather's great, people are great. Shopping's great. I mean, it's, it's a good place to live. There's always festivals and places to, to go with, with families, which I think is a nice place, because it's nice to be able to take your kids with you. You get two choices here. Hillside with views, or flatland with uh, a lot of walkability, and uh, so there's that choice. Uh, I live in the hills, but a lot of my friends in, uh, live uh, on the flats, and they love to just be able to walk to restaurants really easily. The homes out here are just immaculate. I mean, they're nice, they're huge. Just the area, I mean, it's, it's nice and quiet, a lot of trees. The White Oaks area that I live in is, it's a nice flat area where the kids can all come out on the street and play together. The neighbors know each other. Um, it's a nice mix of neighbors. You've got older people living with newer families that have just moved in, so. It's a nice sense of community in the neighborhoods. I've taken my boys up to Edgewood Park and we've gone hiking. Um, we've gone to Burton Park ever since we moved here. Uh, the kids you know, really enjoyed playing at the park when they were growing up. We were involved with the library when we first moved here because the library had some nice activities for young children. There's band concerts in the park in, in the summer. There's uh, the Art and Wine Festival. There's um, one of my favorites, which is uh, the Thursday uh, farmer's market that starts at 4 o'clock and you can collect your dinner and whatever and it goes on till 8. It's a terrific option here uh, with organic produce. They're good local neighborhood schools. Kids can walk to school and they're safe. I'd be happy to send my kids to any of them. One of the reasons we moved here was because of the schools, which were, you know, really good as far as test scores and things like that. All the mothers seem to be really active schools and the teachers seem to have them all involved and I think that's a, uh, that's a good thing. People don't move in and out of here that e quickly. They, they, they come here, they move, and they live here to stay for a while. It's a quaintness. There's no grandiosity. It's more of a, I think, a kind of comfortable all-American town. 